Hey guys, it's Friday. Um, I know I haven't made any videos in a long time, but um, today I decided to change that. I just finished making my first ever tattoos and piercings video, um, which also featured my daily jewelry and um, the, like the stuff that I wear every day. So um, yeah, I just wanted to update you all on a bunch of things. Um, the walls aren't orange. Uh, that's because I'm in my uh, the basement of my house. Um, my computer was down here and I was just too lazy to take it up right now. And so I figured I'd just make a video down here. Change of scenery type thing. Um, I'm 19 now. My birthday happened a uh, month and a while ago. month and a bit ago. Um, so yeah. I had a fairly good birthday. I got a pocket watch and um, yeah I love it I haven't worn a watch in forever and um, I got a new tattoo it's so hard to like point my hand down to show you guys and um, I uh, talked all about it in the tattoos and piercings video that uh, I just posted so you guys can check that out um, I'm in my first year of university now I'm so surprised that I'm even going. Um, yeah, I'm studying film because I love working with cameras. Not so much being in front of cameras, but um, one of the things I need to learn how to do is uh, better market myself. So I figured, you know, keep making videos and putting myself out there and eventually I'll get to work for somebody or work with somebody. Um, yeah, I'm going to university now. I had one class this morning, so I'm home in the middle of the day. Tried uh, uh, applying online for jobs, but my computer is really, really slow. I'm going to have to try one of those disks that um, can make your computer run faster. We'll see if it works. Um, oh, I don't know what else to say. Slurpee! It's a cream soda and Dr. Pepper, and except it's all melted. And um, I started getting into a uh, new artist. Well, she's not new, and I've listened to her before, but her debut album is a new genre. And so I was kind of iffy because it's not a genre that I usually like, but I figured, you know what, I'll, I'll try it and... Like, I listened to a bunch of the songs online, and they're really awesome. The artist on the album is Cassidy Pope, and the album is Frame by Frame. And it is really good. It's, like, it's kind of country-ish, but it's really, really good. So, um, yeah. I've been, like, listening to that a lot. Um, oh, if you've been watching my videos a lot, you would know that I had braces in uh, I think all of the videos except for these most recent two, I got my braces off the first day of university so I'm super happy about that I hated having braces I have a retainer now though but I'm not gonna be wearing them during my videos until I know for a fact I can uh, talk better because right now my speech is all effed up so yeah I don't have braces anymore feels so good and, uh, yeah. Oh, I so don't know what to say. Um, well, I was gonna make this into a separate video, but since I don't know what to say in this one, um, I've been, uh, looking up and looking into these new Nerf toys. I know, I'm 19 and I'm looking into toys, but whatever. And, um, they're the new Nerf Rebel toys. There's, like, guardian crossbow and the heartbreaker bow and there's a whole bunch of different toy guns uh, like nerf guns I don't really like guns so I don't want to get those too but I want to get the crossbow and the bow and arrow because I think they're really cool and I've seen a lot of comments online where people are just like oh it's you know you're gendering toys and all this stuff because I'm taking a women's and gender studies class in university and so I'm learning a lot about like things being gendered and that kind of thing and it's like 
Murph has been gendered towards boys for so long, like since its inception pretty much. So for them to start marketing toys towards girls, it's going to make it easier for them to like start making their toys more neutral. Like if you get girls into Nerf, then eventually, you know, you don't have to have boy Nerf toys and girl Nerf toys. Eventually you can just have like Nerf for everybody. And I think it's an awesome idea and I think that the Nerf Rebel line is so cute and it's pretty and yeah, oh, cute and pretty, that could be a bad thing because it's like, it's gendered and all this stuff. I don't think it's a big deal. Honestly, it's like, it gets girls into more active toys instead of just always sitting around and playing with dolls. Because, yeah, when you're like seven, eight years old, you don't know very much about gendering unless you had parents who taught you about that stuff. Like, you can't help it, you play with dolls and like clothes and stuff. So to have like a pink bow and arrow and to like be running around outside with your friends and and that kind of thing, it gets it gets little girls more active. So I think it is an awesome thing. I'd love to know what you guys think though. So um feel free to comment. And um starting with this video, I'm gonna be posting uh, my links. I don't have that many. I think the only ones I'm going to have are my Tumblr and my DeviantArt, but I would love if you guys check out my Tumblr. I post a lot of my personal thoughts on there, so I'm just going to warn you right now. Sometimes, you know, it's a little depressing, but... And then my DeviantArt has a lot of the photography that I do. A lot of the pictures are of me. But it's not because I'm vain or self-centered, it's because I'm trying to feel better about myself. And putting myself out there in that kind of way is, uh, it's, it's how I'm trying to, you know, build up my self-esteem and my confidence. And, you know, not just, like, hide from people and only post song lyrics. Because that's what I do on my personal Facebook. And I'm not going to link that one because that is my personal Facebook. I only post... Uh, are, I only have people on there that I've met in person beforehand, like friend of a friend sometimes or that kind of thing. But I'd love it if you guys check out my DeviantArt and my Tumblr. I'd love to know what you guys think. And yeah, I have a guitar lesson today and I really should practice. So I'm probably going to do that after I... Uh, upload the tattoo tag video in this video. So I hope you guys have a great day, great weekend, and I'm going to try and start making videos more. I got inspired to start making videos again by talking to a girl from my women's and gender studies class who uh, makes a lot of YouTube videos actually I found out. And her videos are really cool so yeah. Um, yeah. I don't know if my hair really looks long, but I'm trying to grow it out, and I've been trying a whole bunch of tips and tricks that I've heard from other people and that I've read online. So, uh, if you guys feel like it, you could comment some of the things that work for you for uh, making your hair softer, healing your hair if you damaged it, and uh, things that you do to help your hair grow really, really long, because I want my hair really, really long. So I'd love any advice or tips or anything you guys can say. And if you guys have ideas uh, for videos that I could do, or uh, if you want me to do any of the challenges that I've heard about, um, I'll try them depending on which ones they are. Because the only one I really know of is like the, the cinnamon challenge and the ice challenge. I won't do the ice challenge though because I've heard that one can be extremely dangerous. Maybe I'll try the cinnamon challenge someday, if somebody dares me to, or if somebody wants to do it with me. I don't know. Um, so yeah, have a great day. Bye.